Mr. Shah. Mr. Shah is an Afrobeat singer from Delta State, a musical producer and a songwriter from Abo. That's Mr. Shah, that's me. Well, <laughs> um, the name Mr. Shah, it's, it's very funny, but you know, a lot of people say Shah, Shah, yeah, I say Shah all the time, but people don't know what's, you know, what's actually behind it. You know, actually it's a story behind my heartbreak and uh, along the line, you know, back then when I was heartbroken, then I used to do this for like, I don't say anytime, any day, so that's Shah, S-H-A-A. -A. Happens anytime, any day. That's Sha for you. I think generally, uh, Nigeria, we are known for Afro Afro songs and Afro beats. So I think my songs are basically Afro and Afro beats. And uh, if I want to define Afro, I think Afro is something. It's music where beats a lot of instrumentals will play and some little voice will come in so i think my kind of music right now i'm doing right now is afrobeat and sometimes i do raga and it's more like um, a dancehall kind of music but they have to if they have to be fusion of afro in it and i think i've done something like um um trap music and there was still something of afro that is called afro trap so i did something on afro trap that's i know where so basically, I do Afrobeat music. All right, I was signed on that Butterfly's record back then in Ghana. But along the line, we had issues. I think they, they never believed in me and, you know, so the contract ended and I moved on to the next one. And I got another deal in the US. And uh, this time around, I didn't want to do more of this record label thing. And I decided to tell the man that I have to partner so it can be business. And we know that we are serious. We are putting out something is business. So it's more of business right now for me than the record label thing. Believe me, I've been, I've been dropping songs since 2014, 13. And I think last year was one of those great years that I really have to thank God and uh, thank my fans, really, well, my family as well. Babi and I know where really, really, really is very impressive. I was shocked when I went to a club in Atlanta and, uh, you know, people were dancing to the song. I was like, I didn't even know I even sang the song, you know, so I was, I was very happy, believe me. Then I think I'm impressed. It's really, it's really massive. It's really going away, and I'm happy about that. Uh, reason behind the song is nothing really serious, and everybody wants to you know. Everybody keep talking about Bob Risky. Bob Risky lives in Lekki, this, that, that, Gucci, and so on. So, you know, they want to live for, they want to live like Bobby, Gucci, Fendi, Ferrari. So, basically, it's Bob Risky. <laughs> My fashion sense, uh, I would say, uh, is a thing from African and a thing from the foreign. So I have this, you know, when when you're bringing Africa, you have to first give um, the kundus to fella. So I would say a little bit, a bit for fella and. Uh, a little bit with the foreign so trying to mix the two together that's my style if you check my video with um, Bobriski, i was only trying to actually sell my kind of person you know i want people to see you know the happy person i am and how jovial a human can live so uh, so my style basically is afro well apart from music and uh, generally I think I'm a businessman. I do business and that's apart from music, I think that's the only thing I can lay my hands on doing. Uh, 
Uh, I would say general. I would say general because even when I dropped my song in Ghana, I was accepted and accepted here. And I'm seeing a lot of acceptance from different countries too. So generally, I'm still building more farm B. So I think I'm still on it and I don't think, I don't know. They are equal. I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. But I think I get more Ghana, I get Nigerian, and more, more of Africa, though. So, Africa generally. Make you tired and say, I know well. I know well. I know well. I know well. Oh, eh, oh, shit about this. Anyway, um, I'm leaving you guys right now. And I'll be no one good, but keep watching Nigeria Extreme. Chocolate music and God bless you.